What's up, everybody? Today, Jamila and I are going to our schools because we want to do some last minute checks. This is like a tradition. Jamila and I always do like a last minute check mm -hmm. right before the school year starts. We come in, make sure everything's in order. Anything we may need extra to do, we'll do that. So we can have us a nice, blessed school year. And I'm about to give y'all a tour of my room. So this is my classroom. If I saw a student like Jamila sitting on my desk, I'd be like, boy, get up that desk. Sometimes, but this is my room. Oh yeah, when folks start getting real comfortable, I'm like, boy, you don't get off my desk. But this is my room. Got a nice size classroom. This is where I have the traditional whiteboard, but I just use that to keep my data so kids know how well they're performing in the class. This is the board I teach off of, and I have. Mm -hmm. So, oh, so your powerpoints are here. Yeah. And then I got another one in the back that I try to use anytime we're doing like a lab for lab data. This is my desk area. Fume hood, in case we use chemicals. Have you ever used a fume hood? A couple times, but never for like, maybe like for storage of something that we're doing, but I don't ever do anything that's like smoking that needs to be ventilated. But this is my classroom. It's very nice, honey. Thank you. I remember when we first got it. Mm-hmm. I love you my classroom. Stool. Man, you got stool. I need stool. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And these are my oh, back. Mm-hmm. And this is my back lab areas. So this is where we do our labs. So I got three tables here. I try to maybe keep this from like five to six students per lab station. But this is my room. Oh I gave you Jamila did give me that. So this is this a student station where they can come? Yeah. I did that for summer school, oh. but I may, yeah, I'm going to need that extra desk. Really? Yeah, because I, I don't have, see, that's the main issue, because we have such a huge student population. I have 29 desks, but my biggest class right now is going to be 32. You, uh -uh. I say keep that desk there and I have, have them, them sit. sit at the studio. But I don't like them sitting back there, huh. because it becomes like a hangout spot. Unless you do a sign scene. But see, I don't, I don't. But you got a whole different yeah, I don't uh, do caliber of students, so. Yeah, I don't do a science student. I don't either, but my students who do sit over there, they they be pretty cool. Yeah. But they can get off task or they can feel like, you know, I don't know. They're not as aware or like they're not as. Yeah. Sometimes. They sometimes. Like so that's like part of my day one, you know, etiquette and room expectations. So here, I got my day one set up. Here's my Flynn Scientific Safety Contract. Here's my corny, typical day one icebreakers to get everybody up and talking. You sit on this stool? Yeah, that's my stool there. I'm about to take one of these. No, you're not. I need a stool now. Here's my lab jacket that Jamila probably gonna try to steal. I can't wear it. I know it's gonna be too big for you. Yep. These aren't yours. No, I gotta get those back to coat. Y'all, so let me go ahead and do this. Traditionally, every year, traditionally every year, Jamila comes in my room. And goes shopping. <laughs> she goes shopping through all of my stuff. Whatever extra I have, it, may, it doesn't even have to be extra. Whatever Jamila finds in the beginning of the school year, every year, she'll wind up stealing it. Yep, I need this. No, I had just replaced that yesterday. I just loaded that up yesterday. Okay. She does this every year, y'all. She steals like a good 20% of my supplies. 20%? A good 20%. 2%. No, 20%. Look at her still going through my drawers. She does this every year. I ain't gonna tell her what my supply drawer is. Right, I'm sorry. <laughs> I ain't gonna tell her where it's at. I got these. <gasps> what? Man, that's my little boy, Timmy. I ain't about to kill Timmy. You about to kill Timmy. Timmy gonna come out while you teaching tomorrow. Oh, yeah. That's one of my things I'm gonna tell my student. Like, we have roaches in it, though. Y'all need to spray. I tell them about the roaches in this class all the time. They don't come do anything. Look at her going through all my drawers. I mean, you ain't got nothing I need, did you? Mm -mm. Pretty much sold out of her. Look. <laughs> See, you got some cute colors. Oh, you need all these. <laughs> Yo, all right. Look, all of my markers. You, you know how you can, so you can take them if you want. You know you want? You know, no, I gotta teach off the whiteboard the whole time. That board? Yeah. And so how you write? 
I, I just used like one basic blue. Yeah, and then I got um. They up in. See, then I got my um. <laughs> Lord. And then I got these right here. I used I used to run through these all the time when I was first teaching. So this is my classroom, y'all. We're about to go ahead and take off. Uh, let me show y'all one more thing, and after that we're gonna leave. Honey, your room needs to stay like this. That's my that's my goal for this year. Is to have my room like see how clean this is. By the end of the year, like paper Yo. all up. Look, by paper, week paper, three, paper. oh, this is going to be torn up. It's going to be torn up. It's going to be torn up. I already know it is. So, look, over here is my recycling center. Um, I'm thinking about going ahead and taking it now. Well, I'm probably going to leave it here just so I can set the trend of kids knowing where do we recycle stuff. Especially with this being a science class, I'm trying to instill in them the importance of recycling waste. Honey, why don't you just put the soap right here? No, because this is my station. This is my station. Oh, no. this your soap, right? Yes, yeah, nowhere here, because I'm a little bit taller than you. It feels better that way. Okay. But this is my classroom, and Monday is going down. I need this. <laughs> you gonna take that whole thing? Good. Angie Miller T. Science, leave that alone. I need this. Uh-uh. Oh, you know what you did ask for? I want it. Like these posted these, but they don't have the lines on them though. No, I don't want it with the lines. I got some of it. Let me see. This is the store space. My mother says she needs some baking soda. Honey, this has been up here since like my first year of teaching. I love looking at that glow. I'm looking at it every time. All right, you need to put it in the room. This is a cute little decoration. Oh, look at it. And you know why I really like this globe? I feel like it gives like the true depiction of like how Who's big Af of Africa is. A lot of time we look on the globe on like typical maps, it makes Africa look it's like small. so small. Mm -hmm. But like Africa is huge. Especially compared to freaking United States. They try to make United States look bigger than mm -hmm. Africa when it's really not. Yeah, or at least like half the size. Not That's not mine. That's not mine. But Lord, you're about to steal my coworker stuff. Where's the rest of it? I don't use that thing. I got an electrical one. Oh, okay. Alright. All right. Alright, Ron. See you Monday. Okay. It's going down, y'all. In 482. Let's go. Alright, so we are in school box. Jamila. Is looking for a. Mm -hmm. They never have chemistry stuff. Here, elements of literature. Literature. Wow. Science chart. Mm. Mm. So we're gonna try to find some posters for Jamila, and after that we're gonna head to her school and put these posters up. But this is where I got like all of my posters. So we got some good and we're headed where we're going no i don't know jamila says she wants to go to ahop even though she doesn't like ahop no i offered to take you because right. you like ahop i don't like IHOP. but we are hungry it's like two o'clock we still haven't eaten all day because we woke up at 12 o'clock no we woke up at like a, we woke up like 10 something did we yeah oh. we're gonna get out the house to 11 50 11 40. but yeah we got some posters um I want some decorations type stuff, yeah. but I couldn't really find anything that I liked. Yeah, so plan.
probably gonna go to the other one. We have a one that Jamil and I normally go to. Yeah, over on Marcel's mom's side. So we're probably yeah. gonna go to that one later on today. Right. And then if we find something, then we'll go to my school tomorrow, tomorrow again. That's right. Y'all, I'm literally about to cry, like so serious. I cannot believe it, but Marcel is finally, finally, finally about to eat at Waffle House with me. So I had to like say, Marcel, you know, I don't like IHOP. Yeah, I love Waffle House. And he's parking. Like, I'm about to cry. Like, I'm so emotional right now. Yeah, I hate Waffle House. But I love I'm Waffle a, House. I'm going to give it another chance today. And then we got to make this quick. Okay. Because we got stuff we got to do. I just think like I pick up my clothes for the dry cleaner so I can have something to wear day one. But it's apparently, like Jamila don't care. I got your blanket coming. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Grab Yo, about to fall asleep. Food was too good. Yay! Yo, if I'm talking with a slur today, I had bit my tongue really bad the other day, and it's like my tongue is slightly swollen. So if I'm slurring a little bit, that's why. Hopefully, it's gone by Monday because I had to teach. But honey, the food was so good. You changed my mind. I had like I'm a so really happy. bad experience with Waffle House the first go around when I first moved to Georgia. Mm. The food was cold. Said look dirty. Oh, I never had no no cold uh, Waffle House. Mm -mm. And then I was all mad, you know, coming from up north, you know, IHOP is like the main spot. Mm. And I was like, what type of breakfast place don't serve pancakes? So Jamila, you. The waffle was good, right? The waffle was super good. It was soft. It was creamy. It was. Look at her head. She's too happy. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> it was really good. But I don't know how much I'm worth now. Because I, I don't know if I'm be able to help Jamila with her classroom. Because I'm like. You'll be in the room sleep. Chair gonna be reclined back. I'm trying to tell you. How many school clothes are for It's 2.43. Oh my gosh. All right, y'all. We got headed to Jamila School. We had to take a, like a quick pit stop break, but now we're about to show you what Jamila School looks like. And after that, or my classroom, not my school. Classroom, classroom, classroom. All right, let's go. And now we are at Jamila's school, her classroom. She wanna go drop the Waffle House off in the refrigerator. But yeah, I'm about to give y'all a tour of her classroom. This is her board that she teaches off of. And these are her student desk. And these are her lab tables, which her students perform lab experiments in it. That's right. This right here above you is in case you catch on fire and you need to rinse off a little bit. This is her fume hood, same as mine. It is not the same as yours. It's a little bit older, but a little bit. Oh, and this is where her co-worker did for us last year. But they spelled Jamila's name wrong, so she didn't bother bringing it to the house. So it'll be a H right there. March 31st is when we got married. So I just did a room tour, but I'm pretty sure you want to redo it. No. no? You show my Promethean board? I did show them Promethean board. Ooh. You show them my desk? No. Y'all. Was that last year I, I built this chair for you? No, because you was in your old room. Two years, two years ago. Yeah, I, I bought this uh, chair for Jamila two years ago, and I built it while she had another room around the corner, and she's been using it ever since. Oh, oh, uh, oh. Uh, why are the chair so comfortable? Honey, I gotta get me a chair. Cause my chair broke. I be leaning all the way back. This chair feels so good. Now, Jamila did not take this chair home over the summer, so I was worried someone was going to steal it. You like what I did in my front? What you do with your front? Oh. I have it on this thing. Mm hmm. That's pretty dope. Instead of, look, it was on this. What was it on, honey? It was on my little plastic cabinet. Oh, it yeah. Because the, the weight. Yeah. Mm hmm. Hey, your classroom is really dope. But we gotta put the posters up. But Jamila has, yeah, we can do that. But Jamila has a nice size room as well. And I wanted, look, I wanted you to, um, I asked them to come in and do it. What? 
Girl, this on the board because I wanted this to be my word wall. Oh, that's why I said maybe I needed to bring my uh tools. Yeah. yeah. So we can we can come back out tomorrow and draw that up. And then I was gonna use these like right there vocabulary words on. Like, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's pretty dope, honey. Honey, can you guess what this is supposed to say? It's supposed to be a word together. Yeah. Oh, genius. Yay, genius, hey, genius, hey, genius, hey, 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 hey. So I gotta figure out where I'm put this in the room. Somewhere in the front so the students can see it all the time. And they can always think of themselves as geniuses. But I ain't got no screens. I know. Honey, what happened to your flower and all your decorative things in here? Where did that it go? That was in the old room. You haven't been in here since then? That was two years ago. Honey, no, but you still had this decorated in the middle of the table, no, though. I didn't. I just had like uh, markers and colored pencils. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. Stuff used to pop out. Oh. So this year, I mean, it's still decorative. That's nice. Yeah, it is. Oh, okay. I ain't trying to play you. <laughs> what it is, man. Nah, that's really cool because it's like they're in chemistry. Then they're like, oh, we got the goggles here. Right. That's really cool. That's really cool, honey. All right, so. You ready to get to work? We need lemonade. All of this. Okay. So I was thinking about putting this on the door. But like it'd be cute if I had like a nail. Oh yeah. Let me see it. Let me see it so the people can see what the poster says. It says teachers who love teaching teach children to love learning. Hey look at this, Miss Smith. I'm gonna go ahead and take all this down. You don't need it no more. Yo, she still got folk calling her. Miss Jenkins. No, what you don't? Yo, we just left the Waffle House, which had one of her old students, and she was like, "Hey, Miss Jenkins." Jamila wants me to set up this aqua sprouts garden thing. It comes with all of these supplies. Here's the tank, the lid, some more lids, the siding, some other crap, a self timer that I may take home because I always need one of these. All right, so let's try to figure out how to set this up. You think I'm gonna get it done today? Me, crazy. You know what I'm saying? Are you asking me? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Alright, let's get to work. Jamila has helped out a tremendous amount. I couldn't have done this without her. There were times since I was tired and still full off of that Waffle House, I could not focus and I made some easy things really hard. 
and she has helped me a lot. <gasps> oh my gosh, this is so cool. That's all you gonna plant? This is all I got. They said big seed. Right. That seed's <laughs> <Sorry>. too small. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God! And look, who eat beans? <laughs> you are. You gonna eat some beans? Oh my goodness! Look, spring liberty, isn't it? Look. <laughs> Y'all see that? <laughs> what are you doing? Day two, back at Jamila's school. Jamila is over here cutting. So yesterday, what we did was we went back to school box on my mom's side of town and we bought some more posters. Better and posters, they're very better pretty, better they're posters. both better. That's right. Yeah. And since Jamila is a science teacher, she found some acid and bases. Chemistry teacher. Chemistry teacher. She's found some acid and bases. Honey, you found it for me, I didn't find this. That is true, I did pick them out for her, but I always like giving Jamila credit. But she found a matter poster a States of Matter poster. She also found a physical and chemical change. She also found an Adams poster. Another periodic table, because if you're a chemistry teacher, you can't have too many of these. A molecules poster, as well as a compounds poster. And all of these empty white binders that you see is what my mom donates to Jamila school every single year oh, yeah, okay. shout out to mom one there. this one yeah. cabinet or the jar cabinet, cabinet. <laughs> and Jamila does give these to her students so they can use them for the students who may be a little less fortunate every student class set it full of binders Lord, her name closed it, right? But shout out to mom. And then we still have some more in here. So, so your mom, your mom oh, yeah. And my mom also donated. Why? First of all, first of all, why does my mom? Because she asked you, do you need it? You say no, then she asked me. And so now she stopped asking you. She just automatically gives it My mom, me. no. My mom takes so much better care than she does me but listen to this and she also donated a laminator machine pretty pretty dope so we're about to hang these posters up we bought some more tape and we're about to hang this outside of jamila's door as a nice warm welcoming sign for her students to come in so yeah, the filter came back on. We're gonna have to get some stuff at the bottom of that tank anyway for the uh, decorations anyway. Yeah, but the sediment can still rise up though. So let me show y'all what Jamil's talking about. So yesterday, as you know, we set up the tank, but I did a poor job reading instructions and I did not clean out all of the dust on these little things right here. So now what has happened is it has made a slight sediment dusty like bed at the bottom. It's been, yeah, 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 it's yeah, this been. This brown too, the big one right here. Uh, mm -hmm. Y'all, it hasn't even been a whole 12 hours <laughs> and these things are already sprouting. Can you see that little one in there? Sprouting. So we got a little one sprouting. Honey, you gonna bring these back to the house to eat? We don't eat peas or beans. Well, dag on it, we grow it, we eat it. Better watch some church online, y'all. Hallelujah.
All right, we are finished. Yes, my room looks so much better. Mm -hmm. I like Jamila's room a lot. It's real welcoming. It's real colorful. The posters really made everything made the room pop. pop. Mm -hmm. Like, look at this poster right here. This poster is like really cool for like a scientific method poster. That is really dope. But Jamila and I want to thank you all for watching. Just keep us in your prayers that our school year is going to go by smoothly. Uh, we'll have a nice, healthy learning environment and all academic and personal goals that Jamila and I go through. Uh, we set aside for ourselves that we'll be blessed to receive such things. Y'all, teaching isn't the easiest profession. You know, we are able to, you know, have vacations throughout the year. But to deal with so many students that have so many personalities, so many needs, it puts a mental toll on you. Mm -hmm. And just keep us in your prayers. Jamila this year has about 70, maybe 70 Maybe students. less, no. Maybe less. I like got 50. like 50 or less, and that's the first time ever. Normally yeah. I have at least 100 students. Right. Me, on the other hand, because she, Jamila sees her students every day because she's on a semester basis. I see my kids all year and I think I and have every other day he sees a student every, every other, other day. day and I think I have about 170 students so just keep us in your prayers um we thank y'all for watching and we're gonna have a good year to all my fellow teachers that's watching this y'all have it. a blessed and good year let's get it teachers that's right so thanks for watching god bless and we'll see you next time all right tomorrow if you're watching this video on monday tomorrow we're releasing my birthday vlog Jamila took real good care of me, and we hope you enjoyed it as well. Yes. All right, peace. Bye.